Valley. Thanks, 303. Copy. Dispatch, I need to run a license check on that 10th. Oh, shit. Uh, Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup available. You didn't do anything. It's gonna be all right. On the ground. Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's dad, he wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So, so what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. We need to find a couch for your yard one day. Ooh, careful. 
Last time, my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Hmm. Nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know? Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa, what the hell are don't you doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. Oh, right. Blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C O N D O. Oh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Whoa, good drawing, Lila. Daniel's teacher would be proud of you. Ha! The pretentious artist has spoken. Don't fall asleep before me tonight, or you might see more of my skills. <laughs> you wish. Ugh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure. But I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, oh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <sighs> really? Hey! No fair. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletail. Hmm. Please, Judge Diaz. Be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week or your poor suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, judge. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. Daniel was guilty of being a brat. 
So the Choco Crisp goes to Senor Diaz. What? No way. You're a cheat. <laughs> nope. I'm the law. Your Honor, I can't let you punish an innocent man. So? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I always knew you'd confess. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. I have to go to work in my room, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Don't hurry back. <sighs> okay. That's right. Que pendejo. It's nice going jogging with Dad every once in a while. Though he's way too chatty. Better pack for the party. I'm not that into cars, but these are pretty bitching. Dad hates sushi, but he orders it anyway for us. If things go well, should I bring Jen back here? Maybe Dad won't like her, or she won't like him. Or worse, she could get along with Daniel. Dude, stop. I'm not even dating her. Yet. What if Jen came over? Mm, we can build a fire and... <sighs> Dude, stop. I could just stay home and binge Top Gear with Dad and Daniel, but... <laughs> Not tonight. I don't know who plays more. Daniel or Dad. Daniel spends hundreds of hours yelling into the mic playing Minecraft with Noah. Geez, how old is this? We've had it since I was 10. Man, is there any more boring sport than baseball? <laughs> but can't wait for the rain. Makes me feel like drawing. Do not enter, ever. <sighs> Trust me, Dad, I won't. Dad tries so hard to get on a healthy diet. I can't wait for him to be real funny, Dad. Meet the Diaz, organization experts. What the? Is Dad baking something? You're coming with me. Gotta bring some munchies. Mm. Maybe this is better. Dad is like a big kid. He gets so hyped for Halloween. Cross that off the list. Food down, drinks to go. Yo, that secret recipe fucking rules, actually. This will work. I 
don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. <laughs> Man, Daniel could live off this crap. <laughs> At least I don't have to help Daniel out with math. Thanks, Dad. Damn, Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. Damn, the guy never stops working. He was so proud to get that. He should be. Will Dad actually take us there one day? <laughs> Doubt it. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? Dad said we could go to Mount Baker this year. The trails are insane. Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. How long is he going to keep all this shit? How long is he going to keep all this Shit. Daniel destroyed our old nativity scene. Sorry, baby Jesus. Dad should just sell that other bike. Can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Well, of course. He asked Daniel too. Bet you, Sean? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, uh, shoot. Must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam came by the garage today. Hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it so I can change its direction. Here you go. Hmm. Should have a flex head. I can't reach that bolt otherwise. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Calloway's just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. Is that it? Hmm. Wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter. Okay, hey, forget it. I'll do it with this one right here. It'll probably work. Oh, shit! All right, never mind enough of this. I'm done. Hey, quick tip, my son. Go Google wrenches 
and see what you can learn. Yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Mm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Well, you don't have to. I mean, it's cool. Are you sure you're my son? You don't want to visit Mexico. You don't want to have a car. I can't even get you into Rush or Santana. Are you going to ride the bus for all your dates? Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock blocking is. He looks up to you, Sean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way. Ha, I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? <sighs> ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Um... I mean, yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. <sighs> Don't worry. We got smartphones and stuff. We can call a ride if we need it. And I can always text you. I try not to. Or, you know, you could have sent my friend request on Facebook so I could keep an eye oh, on... Oh, my God. Okay. I have to go. Thanks, hey, Dad. Hey, hey, Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Okay. Have fun. But not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. Dad's a pain in the ass sometimes, but he's awesome. I would be fucked if I had to help Dad in the shop. It'll be weird having my own car, but then I could take Jen out if she wants. The saw almost took my thumb off once. No more 4th of July fireworks after last year. Dad's had this forever. I'm glad he doesn't make us go to church. Running the garage was Dad's dream. I'm proud of him, honestly. Okay, gotta go back to the living room and load the backpack. Well, it's not my turn to do the laundry. Daniel better not use my toothbrush again.
Hey, Jen. What's up? Oh, try again, loser. Hey, you look totally hot. Oh my god, stop. Oh. Hey, you wanna share my blanket? Hey, Jen. Do you wanna hang out sometime? Not bad. Remember, don't be too thirsty. Dude, come on, open up. Why? Because. Okay, okay. What are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? You gave my choco crisp to Dad. So what? He gave it back. Dude, you're so spoiled. What's with the sisters? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Oh, man. Damn, sounds pretty serious. Should I call an ambulance now before it's too late? Maybe. <laughs> All I can say is watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is going to be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will Lila be there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. Did she ask about me? Yes, she wants to marry you. Shut up! And I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Of course you do. We almost got caught by a crazy old dude. But it was such a blast. This was such a cool day. Can't wait to go back out there with the crew. Asshole. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. Very funny, Lila. Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. Damn. I still have like 10 books left in the series. I won't finish until I'm 20. Oh, hi, Gunther. Sorry. You stay hidden here. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. We got these for free during sex ed last year. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. <laughs> right. I should practice instead of putting it up here. But it looks pretty rad. Told them not to take a picture of me after the race. <laughs> I look like a sweaty pig. I'll never make varsity at this rate. Thanks, Daniel. I'll, uh, treasure this gift always. I really like that one. <laughs> I don't totally suck. That would be sick to just go 
Tat would cut my arm off if I got a tat like that. But when I turn 18... Time to get in the mood for tonight. How many times have I watched it? From the point Not enough. From the was made, but the cable to the Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. His little hand grasped in anguish as he weighed up his coin. Somewhere a blue-eyed girl in the world is just... Okay. Don't be a stalker, Sean. Man, this is taking forever. Do they want me to pay for it? Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. Promise me you follow what it says. Eric got us some purple last month. It was fucking insane. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. My first hangover. Dad laughed at me so hard when I came back home. Finally ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so we're set for the night, in case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else. Ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? Well, I don't know. Play it cool, talk about the gig last week, get to know her tastes. Oh my god, you did rehearse your moves for tonight. You're totally into her. Duh. Why do you think I'm freaking out? She's so super cool. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean, I'm done. Look, I made zombie blood. It's um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just the... Just bugging the uh, shit out what? of me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, what? I know. Anyway... Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? But... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it up to him. He knows I can be a dick. I'm just stressed out about tonight. No, oh, please. We're gonna have so much fun. Maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Let me see that drawing. This might be my masterpiece. Well, yeah. It's my portrait. Ooh, 
Oh, shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh. You will see. No reaction, no like, no nothing? Hey, uh, I don't appear like a stalker or something. <laughs> okay, okay. Touche. Leave me alone! I'll call my dad! Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, hey. Don't ever touch my brother! <laughs> You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt. Look! I told you, it was an accident. You better leave us alone. Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Dude, did you get that blood on him? Uh, it was... It was an accident. I swear. He's a fucking retard. See what happens when you don't listen? Dad told you to stay in the yard. I know, I know, Sean. I was just acting like a zombie and I forgot. I swear. I swear. Where? Take the little baby back to his crib. Come on, Daniel. We're done. Yeah, go back to daddy. Pussies. No wonder your mom bailed on you. <laughs> ah! Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <sighs> you and your whole fucking family are going to jail! Losers! What? What's going Fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean! Is he hurt? Okay! Okay, step away! Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating me. up my little brother! Ground. Now! Hands behind your Sean. head! This is fucking bullshit! Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? Get on the ground! Sir. Dad! We didn't do Sean, anything! Sean, be quiet! I swear! Officer, Shut listen. up! I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, Be quiet. I want to go home. They're good kids, officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. I said don't move. We didn't Daniel, do anything. It's going to be all right. On the ground.
No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being being at home or or in your room. This is a a real adventure, right? So come on. Let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you, okay? Okay, but I am so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know, I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome possum. But next time, Dad better give me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, <laughs> Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We could be wolves. Yeah, yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once, huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I, I, tag your ass and no. run. You're it. No way, not fair. Whatever. Okay, I'm a zombie and I'm gonna eat you. Blah!
Are we there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. I told Daniel not to walk here, so I should probably do the same. Here, Man, hope the driver isn't around so watching us. Huh? Welcome to Nowhere, Washington. Yay! Huh? I see something. What is that? Now we can see where we are. Whew. There's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No. Duh. It's way too cold for your skinny butt. Okay. Let's just hope that doesn't happen while we're here. I'm sure there's no bear around here. I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us? And they're hunters. You're too little to hunt. We're cool. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. Should be fine. That showed me how to read these when I was eight. Daniel, check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze, and people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. Only dad was here. How? No reception in this shithole. Stop thinking about that. Get over yourself. Like anybody's gonna pay in the middle of nowhere. I wonder what dad is doing right now. Do you think he's worried about us? Worried? No. He knows how tough we are. Man. We haven't seen one of these for miles. Man. People don't even read the signs. <sighs> okay, dude. Do you have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. Uh... Well, maybe I'll go. But don't let me get stuck in there. Don't worry. I'll call the forest plumbers if you fall in. Gross? These are worse than the ones at school. 
<laughs> Especially after you use it. Sean? Look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. Dad always knew exactly where to go. He was a living compass. <sighs> well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Man, what are we doing out here? Well, sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Where are we going? Huh. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. We don't have much. Hey, Sean. This is I better than these. nothing. I don't I have one, much. Please? This is better than nothing. Sure. Treat yourself. Mmm, delicious. This place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I don't think Dan will understand. I'll leave that to the zombies. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. We're not that desperate yet. People write some stupid shit sometimes. This is stupid. so tired. Feels like we're walking nowhere. How am I supposed to take care of us out here? I don't even know what happened back there. To that cop. Or Daniel. How can that be? Whoa. Look at that. Yeah. So cool. Never seen you get so jacked up over a nice view before. So? I've never seen anything like this. Never, ever! Yeah. I guess you haven't. I remember when... Dad... I wish Dad was here with us. Well, thanks. Not cooling off anymore? Yes, you're super cool. But... I just wish the family was together, at home. It'll be cool to watch a movie and get a pizza and eat ice cream. Dude, stop. I told you we have to keep going. We'll see that later. Right now, it's just you and me, okay? Yeah, it's our park. We can do whatever we want. That's right. So, we better go build a, a secret base so we can hide out for the night. Are you ready? Yes. I can build anything. We just have to find some cool blocks around here. And be careful of creepers.
Okay. Let's go. What would happen if someone actually catches us? I found some more! Now we know what not to do, right? I guess. I don't like it here. Just like the trails Dad used to take me on. Picnic and hiking site. Well... I bet nobody comes out here to picnic anymore. Well, that's good for us. No camping? Uh-oh. Don't worry. Nobody's gonna find us out here. Do not feed or disturb the animals? What? What kind of animals? Like bears? Or coyotes? Or... More like squirrels, rabbits, critters. Just don't bug them and they won't bug us. They're way more scared of us than we are of them. Unless they're angry or hungry. Okay, come on. Don't freak yourself out. Let's go. I'll give you 10 seconds to find a hiding spot, and then you're toast. Turn around so I can hide, and don't look. One, two... Come on! You're cheating! No peeking! One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm coming. Okay. There you are. Aw, no fair. You were peeking. Not when I could see your foot a mile away, dude. I win. I win. Whatever. I bet nobody knows what they mean anymore. What does that one say? It tells us to go sh Whoa! Sean, did you see that? What if the raccoon came with us? He could be our pet! Man, raccoons are not a pet. You ever see their claws? Yeah, but this one likes me. Until you run out of food. Let it go, Daniel. <gasps> That's one big tree. Daniel, you hear that? Oh, fuck. 
I have no idea where we are. What I'm doing. Is that a bird's nest? Oh, yeah. They're everywhere out here. At least they have a home. Come on. Ugh. Pretty high up. Uh, Sean? What the hell is that? Uh, uh, I should have listened in biology class. Sean! Come on. I got you. <clears throat> Phew. Thanks. Dude, you struck out. That did not scare me. Liar, liar! Uh, I saw your face. That was, uh, surprise. Maybe you scared me for like one second. <laughs> I got you, I eat you. Don't mess with the zombie. We have to watch out for skeletons. Ooh. Looks like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there? I don't know. Come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. <laughs> cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right. Yes. Uh, so what do we need? Okay, I, I needed to build a camp to keep out all those creepers and whatever. And I'll take care of finding the wood. Deal? Yes, I can build traps too. Nothing will get to us. Awesome, dude. I know. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming!
Let's see. Here's a good spot. Now this is perfect. Nice and dry. Hmm. That's enough for a toasty fire. We've been walking for so long. I wonder how far we are from Seattle. Hey, this isn't too bad. I guess Daniel can chill a little. Hey, can you give me a hand? Yeah. This is the best way. Yo! What are you doing? I'm trying to move this branch to protect the base. Good call. Here, let me take this side. You got it? We'll see. Go ahead and push. <sighs> we did it. Nothing can get in here now. Damn right. Nice work, Daniel. Cool. I'll go check the river. We're doing okay together. He's such a little guy. But he's staying strong. Check this out, Sean. Whoa. Nice view. You can see so far. No. Come on down. We gotta eat. All right, and I know. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. We make fire. Can I help? You have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes. Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry, sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. Wish we had more. 
I know. Me too. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. <gasps> yesterday was yesterday. Now that we're out here, we have to do everything ourselves. Right? Okay. But you'll help me if I need it, right? That's what I'm here for. And you gotta help me too. I could really use a smoke. Man, this is Man, the I made a fire tonight. Ever. That would Nobody's be proud. Gonna find us. Nice, Sean. Beers are exactly what we needed for survival. Now that's a fort. Good work, little bro. Look, a full moon. <laughs> it's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Dude, we are the wolves. Ow! See? Ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! We're almost broke. How do we eat tomorrow? Wonder if I'll ever go back to school after this. You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. It's not your fault. Shit happens. Brett deserved it. Why can't I remember? Uh, that's weird. Um... Uh, don't worry, dude. You were running around all day. You tired out. It happens. Funny how a little food chills Daniel out. Uh... I'm so tired. Oh, you look tired. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet hurt. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. <sighs> better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Yeah, you're like a... a real wilderness expert. <sighs> That's cool. Why is not stay open, Sean? Sleep tight, bro.
Dad. Dad, where are we? Daniel? Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. That's all. Sean? Where... Where are we? Right here. In the park. Remember our amazing fire? Um... Yeah? Are we okay? Uh... You fortified our base, so... We're perfect. Um... I did. You're right. Go... Go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might... You won't. I have another scary dream. Just... Just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel. Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. You just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. A four secret milkshake factory. <laughs> keep dreaming, dude. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Oh. Remember that time? Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry. But he didn't like his, so he said he was gonna get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. You never believe me. Hey. There's something ahead. Yep. Must be the gas station we saw on that sign. Oh, come on. Stay off the road. Be a good example. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food. Water and plus a map so we can find the best route. All right. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but tonight will be better. I swear. Yeah, I hope. Wonder what they're doing here. Maybe they got some extra food. Goddamn voicemail here. There's nothing to do here. When do we leave? Um... Uh, hey... Hi. Uh-oh. Here it comes. Oh, hi there. Uh... It's a really nice weather for a picnic. Isn't it? So what are you boys doing this gorgeous day? We're camping for the weekend. But um, we, my dad forgot to bring our groceries, so we had to come here. Oh no, 
I hope you didn't have to walk far. Where are you camping? I don't know the name of the spot. It's over there. That way. You don't know the name of your campsite? Hmm. Okay. Hey, happy Halloween. My brother's a zombie. Don't you have a costume? Nuh-uh. I'm 11 years old. Halloween is for kids. Oh, my brother loves it. I don't. I'm almost 12. Excuse us, but we're having lunch, so... Yeah, we're having lunch. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Sorry. Didn't mean to bother you. Um... Oh, uh, well... We gotta get going. You look busy, so... Have fun. Bye. Take care. I want Coco. Honey, this is a gas station. There might be some leftovers in it. Fuck, is this our life now? Not while these people are here. Don't want to freak them out. It's weird. This will be my first Halloween away from home. They're still looking for us. We can't go back. Can't let Daniel know. Not right now. Last night was so cold. I don't even want to think about ice. Dad always had a thing for gas stations. We stopped at so many on our road trips. He says they're all kind of the same. They feel familiar. Almost like home. The same bad coffee. Same nasty toilets, same food. But I don't feel at home at all. Sean, I'm hungry. Can we go eat something, please? Um, yeah. Sorry, just daydreaming. Okay. Let's go. No thanks. I already have one. Nachos and cerveza? Hey, look. You sound like an They're expert douchebag. Este tipo es un idiota. Um, maybe some other time. I'm fine. I'm too young. Hello there. Hey. Let's Dad would have loved this so much. Ten across. New generation. Oh my right. god. I'll just bust out my standard. platinum card. Hey, come here. Check it out. Look. It should be called Daniel's Cash Trap. Sorry, dude. You'd had to drag my ass to make me come back here after all this. No tourist is gonna do this shit. Wish we could join the crew, guys. Sean? 
Might on Pupper Road cred. Daniel deserves this. Come on. Can't go wrong with these. I hope Halloween is ruined for Daniel by all this. We can live on bread for a few days if we have to. We can't make a fancy sandwich. The bread will be just fine. Lila would love that. Like another world. Mm, hot dog. Yes, gas station food is nasty. <laughs> but I like it. I'm too nervous to drink any coffee. Do not drink that coffee. If you like coffee. I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Ah, uh, no. I don't mean... I mean, it's not as weird as it seems, though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just naked. I mean, if they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? Nobody. Yeah, I agree. Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. I'm kind of an online traveling journalist. Sean. What's a online traveling journalist? Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car, writing about people and stuff. There's a few websites that pay me for these papers since I know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Yeah, we're on the road, going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up against the deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. Dude, I know. Maybe not as good as dad's, but yummy. We could live in that, but there's no way we can pay for it. After last night, I would kill for one of these. Shit, we could just camp out in here. I know Daniel would love to have a souvenir. Ah, oh, man. Daniel would love that thing. Pretty sweet. Seriously. Who's buying all these wooden bears? Oh, we do have a sale on our famous bears. Buy one, get one free. Great. Daniel's gonna be all over that puppy. Daniel, come check this out. What? What is it? It's a puppy. Super cute. <laughs> yeah. Super cute. Is this yours? No, just another stray mutt. Aww, he must be sad. What's his name? That's a she. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy? Please? <sighs> Sorry, man. No way we're taking a dog with us. 
We need adults to take care of her, not kids. See? Sorry about that. Now let's go. But... Yeah, we're not from around here. Get over it. Starts with... Yes? Can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. We're camping. Yeah? Where? I... I can't remember the name. It's not far. So where are your parents? Oh... Oh... This is just for me and my brother. No parents allowed. By yourselves? All the way out here? We know. We come out here all the time. Just not right here. Hmm. You don't look like everybody else who stops by. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah. I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. Here. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. See the baby bear, Daniel? Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, bear. So cool. Then he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Wow. Did something interesting happen here? Oh, that's my husband up there. He built this place 30 years ago. Yep. Who's the guy with him? Is that supposed to be someone famous? Yep. That's a famous Hollywood director or something. He made a show up here, but we don't watch TV. Nice man. Don't think he liked our coffee. Perfect. We should be able to find our way with this. Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. Hmm. Never heard of that team. Hey, look. Empty table. Oh, let's grab it. And check out this map. Hey, come on in. Let's wash a little. Oh, I'm coming. Fast. Ugh, my hands are ice cubes. Okay, you're done. Nice. Free water for us. Are we good to go or? Do you need to... Ma, ah, it's okay. I went in the woods... Stop watching me, perv.
You don't flush. We call the cops. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? Uh, is that all we've got? Sorry, you know. Better than nothing, right? Yeah. Really? You got me a choco crisp? Of course I did. You deserved it. Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south, I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday, but it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. Hmm. We have to be somewhere southwest of Mount Rainier. We slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. Oh, damn. Where can this be? All right. This is it. Are you sure? Yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Aww, but it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. Hey, kids. Looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah, just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watching. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you paid for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir, we paid for this. And the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Daniel, get out of here! Huh? Go! You stay. Daniel, no! <clears throat> you might be interested in. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. Thank you. What the fuck? Where am I? Oh, shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. 
police will get those two straightened out. I'm not sure about this, Hank. I don't know. Then they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, then. Well, I'll let you deal with it. Oh, hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? It hurts. I didn't pop you that hard. You're all right. I, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Just let me use the bathroom. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out in the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Come on. It's only plastic. scared shitless. I can't leave him out there. Okay. Looks like he's gone for now. Wonder if I could get more light from it. Yeah, we get it. You're the perfect Americans. Daniel? I'm right here. Are, are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods. But I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Inano. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you. We have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. Can you try and open this vent? Yes. Ouch. It hurts. Sorry, Sean. Don't Don't worry. We'll figure something out. I don't even want to think of this asshole reading the same magazines as Dad. Oh, yeah. This racist shithead is a real pillar of the community, all right. I'm sorry, but you married an asshole. what I thought. Fuck. Hey! The old guy's gone. Maybe you can enter from the store door. OK, 
Okay. Okay. Looks like he's gone for now. Hey! You, you think you can open the back door? Come on, Sean. We gotta hurry. It won't open. It's locked. What do I do? I don't know. Let me think. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is, but be careful. It might attract him. <sighs> of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Closer. I don't like it out here, Sean. Right. I need something. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy, like a, a screwdriver or a wrench, anything. But where can I find one? Enano, I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Okay, okay, I'm looking. yourself out, dumbass. Take a breath. Oh. Is this what you wanted? This is it! You rule, Daniel! Come on. Let's do this. Yes! Good job, bro. Stay cool. You're... You're doing great. Uh, Come on, you mother... Yes! Score! Did you do it? Here, here. Come on. Did that asshole hit you? 
Did he? No, he tried to grab me, but I got away. Okay, we need to cut this off fast. How about these? Dude, you rock. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. What happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's okay. You're safe now. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your life. The hell with you. Get the fuck off me, bitch. Run, Daniel. I'm right behind Get you. Get back here, you shit. Come on. Come on. Wait. Shit. Watch out! Over there! L let's go! I don't know! Whoa, whoa! What are you doing out here, man? You almost scared the shit out of me! You guys okay? I don't look okay. That asshole! At the gas station! You're fucking crazy! He tied me up in his back office! I swear! Dude. No more. I believe you. Okay. Shit's crazy out in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us. And I thought I was having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Did he mess with you too? He started to earlier, but I bought too much stuff just to piss him off. Welcome to Redneck Land. This ain't Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. Kinda lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. <sighs> Daniel. What? We <laughs> saved her. We're heroes. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But uh, we couldn't leave her with those mean people. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. He's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. 
We need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. Just, just stop. You win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. She's gonna be so quiet. And, and, and what should we name her? Hey, your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, Mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> mushroom. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> so, what do you do exactly? Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protests, try to make some positive change. Eh, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Are you, like, famous or something? <laughs> More like, or something. People in my network know who I am and vice versa. Yeah, that's enough for me. <laughs> Sounds pretty awesome. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous, too. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah. And feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious.
Look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. And I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops in, and they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... <laughs> Fucking cops. <laughs> hey, it's gonna be alright. Take a deep breath. <sighs> Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere and you're taking the brunt of it right now but you're gonna be okay sean how wish i could go back to my town even if it was boring like that one at least i've had friends family a home I used to bitch about it so much. Now I've got... nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but... What you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Cut question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it. Go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. <sighs> Maybe this is crazy, but... Should we just keep going? Till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No. No way. She's... out of the picture. But Dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Lobos. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay, 
So you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. Listen, I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. Okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <laughs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Too bad sandcastles never last. Guess I could play a little with these two. Hey, let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay, but I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, Mushroom. Get it. Go, Mushroom. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. <laughs> you go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, Mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen... I don't want to freak you out, okay, but you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Really? You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Bloody. to... You're not leaving? Are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay, you win. Thanks, Brody. Feels good. Here, looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. 
I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. Okay. Good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. Do you think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If we're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. I'm gonna throw you in, cave boy. We can watch TV too. And there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice and warm. <sighs> this bed is soft. What about this one? Uh, not bad, but too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Want to play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, bud. Ready? I am so ready to beat you. Aw, shoot. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. Hey, a deal's a deal. Sorry, little bro. You gotta accept Aww. it. Aw, okay. Don't start pouting. Come on. I'm not. All right, I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pig <laughs> I wouldn't be so sure, cave boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of Course you will. Prody gave us some cash so we can take one of these tomorrow. They're headed south. Yeah, let's go hike tomorrow. Just for fun. <sighs> yeah. Fuck Halloween. Wish we could go there and pretend nothing happened. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke. Couldn't care less now. <sighs> I could use a serious bong rip right now.
Hey, can you turn that down, please? Uh -huh. Okay, okay. I used to be all over that show, too. At least it's keeping Daniel busy. <sighs> yeah. Don't think we'll be coming back this way. Thanks for everything, Brody. I'll be extra careful. Man, wish we still had Brody around. This episode is awesome. You should sit down and watch it with me. Time to be a kid again. Man, this hot water is going to feel so good. Fill her up. Yuck, Sean. It's a condom in my bag. Gross. Hey! Don't touch that! My hair feels like it's coated in dirt. A shower after Daniel will be bliss. Mushroom, look! It's Dude, hot dog nail. You really look like shit. Bet he won't hate taking a bath after this. He needs that heat. Man, this hot water's going to feel so good. Daniel will love this. Hey, Daniel. Bath's ready. What? Already? Can I finish this episode first? <laughs> no, man. You smell so bad, there's no time to lose. Oh. Hey, you smell too. Oh my god. Whoa. So many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. Thanks. And no, the dog is not taking a bath with you. Okay, okay. Don't worry. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. He'd freak out if he saw me. Time to say goodbye to modern life. Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this, or she'll get into trouble too. Sean? Hey, Lila. Sean, is that you? Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel. With Daniel. <laughs> Shit! Everyone's looking for you here. How about you? Are you okay? No. Everything's fucked up. I'm so worried about you. The 
cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It won't be okay. I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. Hell no. The cops will throw my ass into jail. Then what happens to Daniel? Stop it. Nothing will happen. We can start a GoFundMe. Get you a lawyer. You know it's not that easy. There's nothing we can do. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. That's bullshit. I'm sorry. I totally hate this. I guess... the freaking fighters are disbanded for a while. Shit actually changes, I guess. So... Where are you going? Um... We're just going... away... for now. I'll call you if I get a chance. I miss you, Lila. Sean, wait. <sighs> okay. Wait. Okay, okay. And action! Daniel, get your butt in here right now. What? What did I do? You forgot to open this present. <laughs> what is this? Socks? Underwear? That's it? Yeah, pretty cool, huh? That's what I got when I was a kid. <sighs> Not funny. <laughs> yeah, it is. Dude, check out your face. Wait, what? What? There's another one here. What is it? Daniel, let me help. Looks bigger than underwear. Oh, what? No way. Can't believe it. The new Playbots? Thank you, Santa. Hey, don't look at me. You were a good boy this year. <laughs> yeah, lucky boy. Daniel, this is for the whole family too, right? So you gotta share with me. <laughs> I wanna play that game uh, where you steal cars and go on high-speed pursuit. <laughs> Dad. You totally suck at games. Oh yeah, track star? I was the dodgeball champ of my high school. So duck! Ow! No fair! <laughs> you guys! Don't crush the playbots! Hey! Let's set it up! Dad! Come on! Ow! Okay, don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. Are you kidding me? Remember that song? Come on, dance! Man, I, I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. You're no fun. Daniel, uh, come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a Coke. Or something. Okay, I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal?
Daniel. Oh my god! Daniel! What's happening? Daniel, calm down! You lied! Dad! Your dad is dead! Why? Calm down, Daniel! Let's just talk, please! You knew Dad was dead! You knew it! Why did you lie to me? I was scared, Daniel. I didn't know what to say. You should have told me. I couldn't believe it either. I didn't mean to. I hate you! You're not my brother! Don't say that. I know I messed up everything. We're gonna get through this. Don't touch me! Daniel, please! Oh, It's okay. <laughs> I want that. <sighs> me too. <laughs> We were gonna see Dad. I'm sorry. I just... Just don't lie to me ever again. Ever. I promise I won't lie to you again. I promise. <laughs> I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. <laughs> what are we gonna do without him? Shh. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Sean, am I a monster? Nothing is wrong with you. You're different. <sighs> okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking... Maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where Dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. He used to tell me bedtime stories too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together. Start. 